Hi, this is Delicious. Welcome to another Delicious review, which will be today a bit different and why you will see in a second. But first, let's have a look on our hero, which is the Czech Army BDP 24-hour Russian money number no. 6. And this is very fresh money. This is uh, best before date is 2000, uh, December 2019. So, uh, I am very curious if how it compares to the older versions which I uh, have reviewed before and why this this is a bit different review the reason why is uh, because I moved yesterday to my new place and it <laughs> looks like this a tons of boxes cases some items are loose so actually I don't know what's inside where is uh, my plate for example and uh, I thought that it will be more difficult, but also uh, it is a very uh, good moment to uh, eat a Russian because I, I I cannot do anything else. Let's start. I cannot find my tripod, so everything uh, will be recorded just uh, using my hands. And uh, this is also the reason why I cannot show you uh, everything like in a normal review but i hope it will be it will be enough and maybe in the meantime i will open a box and suddenly i will have my tripod as usual inside we have uh, this cardboard box and we have also a list of components in czech also in english so uh, we 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 can be prepared for what's it's coming for my break breakfast, I have chosen a light crisp bread. This is chicken, uh, sorry, pork liver pate, a small chocolate, a peach jam, a can of salad, Mexican salad, and we have also multivitamin drink here and black tea and some napkins. I think that the content of the box is enough for uh, not three but four meals. And I guess I will do this this way. That's how it looks inside. We have the tea, uh, this instant multivitamin drink, the salad, which is basically corn, peas, and bell pepper, and that's it. The pea jam, the chocolate, which is already bloomed, and this pate. Mm. Actually, I have read the list of ingredients and it looks like the american food so a lot of a lot of additions additional components and preservatives and enhancers and whatever and the crisp bread let's taste this jam actually the smell reminds me more apples than um, peaches but i will try it on, on its own first but the taste is a nice surprise it is really a peach flavor, no doubt about it. Just the smell was uh, a bit unusual. So now with this crisp bread. Okay, this peach flavor is strong enough to combine well with this crisp bread. So it's a good idea. Have a sip of this multivitamin drink. Quite nice, I have to say. Um, this is lemon drink, but not too sweet and not. It it doesn't contain any strange taste or aftertaste. Something like just um, fruit juice. Let's try this Mexican salad. These are plain canned vegetables, so nothing exciting. But on the other hand. The corn is crispy, so I guess it's a good will be good addition to this pate. Let's start with uh, trying this on its own. It's very um, soft, spreadable, quite a decent taste. Um, with, of course, you can taste the pork liver, which is a very strong kind of flavor. But I have expected something worse. So now let's have it on the cracker or this crisp bread. 
I think it is even better with the crisp bread because you have this taste of liver a bit balanced. I have also tried the tea and it is quite decent normal black tea mm, and it is not that bland and so, sometimes you can find in rations. So for uh, end of the meal a bit of chocolate. The chocolate is really good it is kind of half bitter chocolate so not too sweet but also yeah, not too bitter and I have to say that uh, it is quite firm if you consider that uh, I have now something like 29 or 30 degrees centigrade in my flat. Let's have a lunch from this Czech Russians. I have two mains so I picked up this one which is really sounds interesting so uh, this was also the reason why I have chosen this many I mean this Russian number uh, because this is hen in cream sauce with pasta so this is not chicken but something older as you can see and we have here the hen meat we have of course pasta we have uh, carrots celery and mm, cream and some other spices we have also instant drink uh, this is fruit drink and this is this bag is for one liter so I will make this whole and I will have some of this crisp bread uh, which is left from the um, breakfast of course uh, I will start first with this moist toilet to clean my hands this is a paper toilet and it's very moist and has a really strong smell this is something like mix of alcohol and uh, let's say some citrus smell but probably it works enough okay now I will make the drink and I will uh, heat it up in a uh, hot water we can start with the lunch as you can see uh, the main dish is hot we have something like spiral pasta here and big chunks of chicken or hen meat and this is and uh, this is just the same but okay everything was stuck together so let's taste let's have a bit of this meat and the pasta the taste is maybe not very interesting I mean this is a taste of stew chicken meat and the pasta is really really tender so overcooked but it's it's quite nice uh, something like black pepper would help here we don't have this in the Russian we have only salt or something like spiciness or maybe some herbs but it's it's ba basic decent meal I would say now this orange instant drink very standard uh, instant drink of course nothing uh, to do with uh, fresh oranges but anyway the taste is pleasant it is not too sweet and not too hmm, strange I would say so now I will finish this together with this crisp bread and we will move to another meal let's have another small meal from this Russian something like afternoon's meal we have here tuna in sunflower oil we have honey and another pack of uh, crisp bread this time this is corn crisp bread and I have uh, coffee and sugar there are, there is a lot of sugar here in the Russian I guess we have six or eight such packages one thing what has changed that everything was silver in the previous version and this is something like mm, a little bit brown or pink so the color has changed okay so let me prepare the coffee and we'll taste let's have a look this tuna is made in Spain and this is a really great quality you can see the big chunk of meat this is honey made in Czech Republic and is a bit crystallized and these are these corn crisp breads 
and our coffee. Okay, so now let me try this tuna. Yeah, as I thought, it is really a good quality tuna. Just natural taste in the sunflower oil, which is uh, always tastes better than in uh, just in, uh, salt brine. Now a sip of this coffee. Well, quite nice coffee, I have to say, but the taste is a bit similar to this Polish coffee, which is uh, in, I mean, in Polish Russians, which is a bit, um, it's made out of the grains, not, uh, not, not really coffee. So probably, maybe it is something mixed. Now let's, uh, I will try this honey. Now oh, the honey is great. It is probably the mixed flower type, but the taste is really rich, sweet, and not just a sweet, but really a rich taste of honey. Uh, it is very difficult to buy uh, honey from Czech Republic here in my country, so it is a rare occasion to taste it, but the taste is great. I mixed up the rest of the tuna with the, the rest of this um, Mexican salad, which remained from breakfast. And I guess this will be perfect. I will add a, a slightly, a little teaspoon of mayonnaise here and it will be a perfect salad. Let's have our dinner. The main dish is green beans with pork meat, which contains green beans and pork meat, of course, but also cream, some onion, uh, salt, sugar, and uh, garlic, some vinegar and some other spices. We have also strawberry jam and some of this crisp bread left from the previous meal. So I will heat it up in warm water and we'll see if it's any good. We can start. The main dish is ready. Everything is open. So these are green beans with pork meat. Uh, these green beans hmm, looks like yellow beans, so probably maybe this is the yellow kind of beans. So we have uh, big chunks of meat, which is something like one third of this can, and the rest is these green beans. Well, the smell is really fantastic. I'll try to get everything at once. This dish is a bit similar to the hen in creamy sauce, but I have to say that the pork meat has um, more flavor than this hen meat. So it is, um, for me, the taste is better. We have also creamy sauce with the cream. And I would add also here a bit of pepper, of course, but this is quite decent. The beans are totally overcooked but you cannot help it. Now we'll try the jam. The jam is decent, but it is not very much taste of strawberries, rather some fruity taste. So for me, this peach jam was a bit better. I checked my reviews and I had uh, Czech BDP three years younger, so with best before date of 2016. And the set is almost the same, I mean, the components are almost the same and I guess the quality is uh, also um, kept I would say so thank you very much this was the review of the Czech army BDP 24 hour Russian menu number 6 2019 thank you for watching and see you all in my next reviews bye